Hello friends, now I'm going to show you how to create, edit and delete your users in PHP MySQL. It's quite easy. Just download the XAMPP software from uh, the link is in the description and open the Chrome browser which is recommended only for me and type the local host slash PHP MySQL and then follow the video. Uh, first of all you have to open the XAMPP control panel. Uh, just start the patch in MySQL. It's already started. So just start it and then type the local first slash php my admin. then go to into the php my admin. here you can see the number of databases which are being created and you have to go to the users option in the users you can have already a default users you should not delete or you should not edit any privileges of the uh, users which will affect your database and you have to create the database by clicking the add user here you can uh, use the text field i am using sqgn the database user name and the host which means always local because you are using uh, just take it in the see you have the local host so you have to uh, select the local host only if you have the field means uh, you can uh, type the one you can instead like that user name uh, you have ip addresses uh, for me it's a local host and the password you can uh, type any password i'm typing sqgn sqgn if you want to generate it means you can click the click the generate option so it will generate a uh, multiple combination of alpha numeric options uh, enabled password uh, then grant create the database with the same name and the create bridges and grant all privileges just create database with the same name and grant all privileges which means you can create the one or more databases like the name which you are going to create at users so you, do, you just don't use that option uh, now you have the many number of privilege options which is comes under the edit of their users uh, the privileges which means if you query means you just you have the permission to only select or insert if you take the only select means so you just check all so that you have uh, you can and have the privileges to access all the database options like database and structuring the database and administration also the limits if you want to limit the uh, querying per hour means you can uh, enter number of values for that uh, then just click the go that's all you have added a new user like that you can uh, add it for so for example if you want to edit your the privileges that means you are uh, limited the user for some privileges you can click the edit privileges and then you can untick the options if you want to uncheck all that means you can click here if you want to check means you can click that's all now click the go uh, in the same window don't uh, press the same uh, another window for go just click the go and uh, it's been updated if you want to delete this uh, database which means you have to click this sham i mean the tick the sham user and then create the click the go it will delete your option actually it has been directly shown uh, you have to create uh, thing databases and you have to delete that by clicking that and press the go actually it's a root folder i cannot uh, delete that so just stop thanks for watching this video